Hi guys, welcome to the multi-award winning Emerald House of Cars. We're a totally unique family run business on a mission to be the best car dealership in the UK. Our commitment is to give you guys the best buying experience you've ever received, whether you plan on purchasing completely online using our free next day delivery service with seven day money back guarantee, or you're coming to the showroom to meet the team. We've made everything as easy and as transparent as possible so that you've got full confidence in choosing Emerald for your next car. A little later in the video, we'll show you how our vehicles are prepared before sale in our on-site RAC approved service center. But for now, sit back, relax, and enjoy the following video. Hey everyone, welcome back to another walk around video. And today we have this 2018 Peugeot 208 1.6 Blue HDI finished in the GT line. And this is in a really nice shade of black. So starting up front, we have our large grill which as you can see has a nice black surround with red accents on it and just above the grill we have a chromed Peugeot badge with red letter in and above that we have the more traditional Peugeot, uh, Peugeot badge and on either side of the grill we have our headlight units and below those we have our front fog light units which are, are finishing a nice black plastic surround Moving on to the driver's side, we have our alloy wheels, and on this example, they are 17 inches, a five spoke design in a nice triple color colorway. So you have a gloss black, uh, you have your silver, and you also have a nice little red accent as well, as you can see there. So moving on the side, we have our nice sporty uh, side skirts at the bottom of the uh, profile of the car. Moving on up, up the profile, we have a nice GT line badge here. So there's a nice chrome strip surrounding the window and as you can see this is a five door example electrically operated ring mirrors which do fold when the car is locked like it is at the minute they are of course body colored and they also have built-in indicators and moving around to the back we have our tail light units very stylish little things these are to get a good view of the back have a good size, uh, good size boot lid with some chrome on it, which includes, of course, the Peugeot badge. Below the boot lid, we have our fog light, and just below that, we have our exhaust tip, and we also have some parking sensors on this Peugeot. So uh, let's have a quick look inside the boot. Get it unlocked. Boot release is below the Peugeot badge, and as you can see, it's a good size boot back here easily fit the weekly shopping in or maybe a buggy or something it's entirely up to you so yeah it's relatively long quite deep and there was but you do have to keep in mind there was quite a big boot lip here closing the boot now and onto the passenger side we have our filler cap and condition of the bodywork paint and wheels are good on this side as well and moving back around the front, which completes our exterior walk around of this Peugeot 208. And join me in just a tad when we'll have a quick look at the inside and I'll show you all the features in there as well. So kicking off the interior walk around, we are gonna have a quick look at the back seat. So as you can see, got a good sized door here. Nice leather effect on the uh, armrest with a nice red stitch as you can see here. Uh, gloss black pull handle, electric windows in the back, and as you can see, the bench is a good size, easily fit two adults back here, three kids, that kind of thing. And it is worth in that you will, you do have more legroom, but the seats are all the way back at the minute. So moving up to the front of the Peugeot, get some side because it's warm in there and it's a really cold day today. So starting with the driver's door card, we have. Again, electric window switches, as well as your electric mirror controls. And a nice gloss black and red accent on the uh, grab handle here. Good size door pocket here, and your speaker as well. You're also getting a uh, brushed aluminium Peugeot kick seal. And moving on to the seats, they are a partial leather and fabric mix in black with a gray accent. And of course, as you can see, there's a red stitch very sporty front seats, loads of bolstering, very comfortable. And yeah, now let's have a quick look at the inside of this 208. Get in like so. Ooh. 
yeah, those, those seats are very comfortable. They are very supportive. They hug you, basically. Get the car started. And as you can see on the uh, instrument dials up here, this car has done a recorded 41,682 miles. And moving on down, we have our steering wheel, which of course is multifunction. So on this side, we have our audio controls. And on the other side, we have further controls for the trip computer and your Bluetooth. So just behind the steering wheel, we have our light stalk, if you can see that there. Yep. So at the minute, the lights are set to dip beam. So let's just turn those off. We also have our indicators on this stalk, as well as our front and rear fog lights, which are operated by doing so. Moving on to the other side, we have our wiper stalk which of course does your front wipers, wash wipe, and also your rear wiper, which also has a wash wipe function as well. Quick look again at the, at the uh, steering wheel. Nice leather surround, perforated leather here, nice and grippy. And also at the top, as you can see, there is a nice black 12 o'clock ring there. And at the bottom, we have some nice aluminium, aluminium inserts. Before we look at the infotainment system, however, let's have a quick look at these buttons down here. The one to your left is the child lock button and the one to the right is the parking sensors button. And just below that we have our uh, headlight height adjustment. And again, looking at that uh, gauge cluster, nice clear set of, uh, set of clocks here. Nice white light coming out from them. Very smart, very nice. So moving on down to the infotainment system. It's a touchscreen unit which of course has radio, your telephone functions, various applications. That's gone back to the radio, I didn't press anything, honestly. Um, navigation, car settings and driving settings. So let's have a look at the radio be before it does it for us. So we have our options, so you have your FM band, um, radio information, traffic announcement, FM and DAB, follow up and RDS. Uh, right, let's go back, and as you can see, it's currently set to capital, which is obviously an FM station, but if we press sources, it will come up with radio and your USB inputs, so you can plug in your phone. For each account, please oh. go to the help section in your app. That wasn't supposed to happen, okay. Um, right, anyway, moving back to the home screen, we have our telephone button, which is just a uh, dial pad. And of course, you can connect your phone via Bluetooth. Uh, your applications are your... I don't know why it keeps doing that. I'm really sorry about this. Um, SMS and photos. And if we go back to the menu, press navigation. Ah, okay. It doesn't have a navigation um, thing inserted, but you can obviously hook up your phone and use uh, Waze and whatnot. Yep, okay. Going to settings, we have our system configuration, ambient settings, language, screen configuration, and date and time. And going back to driving, we have various other things. So you can turn traction control on and off here, which is a fun thing to do, but obviously you have to use it under correct safe conditions, etc. We don't advise people being silly in their cars. And yeah, that's about it for that. Ah, there we go, we've got vehicle settings as well. So that you can also control like um, your headlights and various comfort settings here. So that's your infotainment system. Let's turn that off. But holding that down, I hope. No, that just seems to be a menu button. So let's go further down and have a look at the uh, dual zone air conditioning system here. Now, of course, like many dual zone systems, you can control the temperature for both the pass passenger and driver's side. I prefer my side quite warm, so the passenger side's gonna get cold, I'm sorry. Uh, we also have our fan speed here. So that's to turn the fans down, that's to turn the fans up. Uh, the direction of the wind can be, uh, not the wind, of the air can be controlled here. The circulation button, air conditioning button, which of course you can turn on or off. I'll leave it off for now. Uh, and your two heated screen buttons. And there's also an automatic um, button as well, so the car will decide for you. Moving on down, we have our 
12 volt socket and a USB input as well as an auxiliary in and there's like a little cubby hole here where you can store your phone or mp3 player uh, you've got two cup holders as well again with a nice little cubby, uh, cubby hole here and you can take the cup holders out like so moving on down we have our five speed gearbox and obviously the gear stick with a nice leverette gator with a red stitch as you can see there and our handbrake which again has a red stitch and a leather um, leather grip handle and we've got two further cup holders here um, that can also be utilized as a storage space so yeah very smart little dashboard keep a lot of people happy and it is quite a good touchscreen for the car in the segments as well so yeah right moving out of the 208 now let's turn it off get back outside Ooh. so that's a that was a walk around of our 2018 Peugeot 208 1.6 blue uh, 1.6 diesel finishing GT line and if you do like the look of this car remember that every car here we here at Emerald is covered by our 128 point check prior to retailing there's Tom one of the salespeople and if hello <laughs> and if you are interested in this 208 please give us a ring give us an email and ask for either Victoria Tom who you just saw there or Greg so yeah that just wraps up another walk around video and we hope to see you in the next one thank you bye one of the most important factors when buying a used vehicle is figuring out who to trust. Buying a car is a massive financial commitment and you need to be 100% confident in the company that you choose. We have over a thousand five-star reviews on Google, Facebook and Autotrader. Hundreds of video testimonials and the jewel in the crown are the multitude of awards we've won over the past number of years, including UK Independent Dealer of the Year, Independent Community Dealer of the Year and most recently, Used Car Retailer of the Year. Integrity and transparency are really important to us at Emerald in how we conduct our business. We're the only dealership with a multi-award winning weekly YouTube show, which pulls back the curtain and lets you see the inner workings of how a car dealership operates. We cover all aspects of the day-to-day -day running from buying, selling, sourcing, after sales, and of course, everything that goes on over at our RAC approved workshop. Every one of our car undergoes a 128 point vehicle inspection by our team of experienced technicians. Any item that aren't up to our approved standards, we rectify and replace parts needed with manufactured approved parts. We also service every car and put a fresh MOT on ready for its next owner. When we are happy the car is in A1 mechanical condition, over it goes to our body shop for paint correction or wheel refurbishment, then finally onto our detailing team. Essentially, we want to ensure that when the car reaches its new owner, it's at its very best. For the road ahead, we've got you covered with a comprehensive 90-day warranty, which can be extended for one, two or three years, depending on your preference. We are proud to be partnered with the market-leading warranty providers that match up to our own high standards, providing customers with genuine support when they need it. We've also got you protected for all unfortunate circumstances, such as having your car written off or stolen throughout your time holding the vehicle. We're really pleased to be able to offer a great RAC gap and return to invoice insurance product, keeping you safe long after you've left our showroom. If you are local to us and want us to take away the headache of keeping your car well maintained, our service plans could be just the ticket for you. Payable monthly and carried out in our fully equipped RAC group garage, every service comes complete with a free health check to keep you and your vehicle safe and secure on the journey ahead and also protect the future value of your car by maintaining that all important service history. And when it comes to protecting your car's interior and exterior against stains, scuffs, contaminants, all of our encompassing Gardex paint and fabric protection ensure the aesthetic appearance of your new vehicle remained unaltered and improved to an almost better than new finish. It's a great opportunity to protect against the best and worst that Mother Nature has to offer. And last but not least, if you do need to take out finance for your new vehicle, we have a panel of over 35 lenders, including Santander, with rates as low as 7.9% APR, always guaranteeing you the lowest possible interest rate. For a fee finance check, which won't affect your credit rating, click the finance tab on our website to fill out a two minute application that lets you know beforehand what your monthly payments are likely to be. We've got loads of PCP, HP, and lease options available, depending on your personal preference and budget. 
So if you want to speak to me or my team of finance experts for any help and advice, please don't hesitate to pick up the phone. We're here to help. Our goal at Emerald is not just to sell cars, it's about creating lasting relationships and customers for life. But don't just take our word for it. Here's what some of our customers had to say about their very own Emerald experience. And how would you rate us out of 10? 10 being probably the best car dealership in the UK. Definitely 10. Oh, I'd definitely say 10. I'm going to say 10. 10. 10, obviously. 10. 10, I suppose. <laughs> definitely a 10. I would give you a 10. Ah, it's got to be a 10. I'd give you a 10. Well, it's obviously a 10, isn't it? Obviously a 10. Mate, right, more than 10. Can I say 11? Straight million. <laughs> Straight, Straight million. Why more than 10? I would say 10. Oh, I'd go as far as saying 11. Definitely a 10. 10, yeah. A 10. I can say 10. In the 11. UK. Well, it's got to be a 10. Definitely a 10. If I could give you more than a 10, I definitely would. <laughs> I'd definitely say a 10. 10. I'd give you a 10. I'd give it a solid 10. I would say 10. 10 out of 10. I'll give you a 10 then. Sounds good. Give it a 10. 10. Don't argue with 10 out of 10. It's got to be a 10. <laughs> I'll give you a 10. But I would rate you a 10. So 10 out of 10. 100%. It's got to be 10 out of 10. Oh, right? That's an easy one, isn't it? It's 11. 11 out of 10. I'll give you 10. Perfect. Because I came back, didn't I? <laughs> and I'll Perfect. be back again. <laughs>